Well, good morning. This morning I'm outside a very busy construction site for the new community nursing unit at St Finbar's. So the recording might be a bit noisy. But Friday I had a great meeting with Ima Hearn and Sarah Shanahan. Sarah Shanahan I've known for many years in New Zealand. And Ima, I'm, I've known about her work for some time in the care of older people. Very impressed with the work on four M's. So making sure that we build what matters to older people into our work that we make sure that they keep moving, that we optimise the medication and that we look after their mental health. We just had to move the recording because of all the work that's going on in construction of the new community nursing unit. On Sunday I was lucky enough to get out into the hills in Kerry, treated to some fine Kerry weather uh, and I was up on the uh, Paps of Anu, uh, very, very windy and cold and wet. Monday, had a great day on Monday, we opened the new Solace Cafe right in the centre of Cork City and this is a centre for people who are in mental health crisis. A, a really very warm speech from Junior Minister Mary Butler and I was privileged to be there with Julie O'Neill and Sinead O'Brien, the clinical leaders and management leaders of mental health services. And then later on in the afternoon we went to see a wonderful facility in Blarney. So Blarney, uh, an old hotel that we think can be very quickly repurposed so we can move patients out of some of our acute hospitals where currently they have nowhere to go. Tuesday I mostly spent in meetings with the centre, mostly online, uh, so I got a chance to, to work from home and I know that not everybody can work from home but I think where you can that's, that's, a, that's a, a really good opportunity. Uh, yesterday, Wednesday, we had a great day at uh, UHK in, in Kerry talking about all the opportunities we have to move patients more quickly through the system. We made some decisions. We decided we'd have very quickly a discharge lounge there. We talked about some of the other opportunities to use beds in the community to move patients who are currently having a delayed transfer of care. We saw the wonderful new laboratory there and that gave us an opportunity to use the old laboratory for clinical accommodation. We talked about the need to put more car parking on site. We talked about the need to utilise a lot of the facilities that we have currently. So I'm hoping that we can get some really good patient flow going through Kerry. We talked about the exciting new developments like the local injuries unit and how we might expand that, that particular facility. And, and then um, I, I came back to Cork and had a lovely um, evening with Tessa Donovan and with Liam Woods, Liam from the centre. Very now today we're having a meeting at St Finbar's looking around the accommodation there. But today mostly is going to be taken up with the local health forum, the regional health forum, where we're talking to councillors about all the great things that are happening in the health system in Cork and Kerry. And then later on we're having a strategic workshop where we'll decide what the planning priorities are for our infrastructure and really talk to our national colleagues to make sure that we have really good handle on where we want to prioritise our developments. For me that's prioritising patients flow through the system and we'll be coming back to you with some of the decisions we've made. So I hope you all have a, a really good bank holiday weekend. Some of us will be working, some of us will be able to take some well-deserved breaks with our families.